if you can't tell, I'm in a new recording area and it's still the same room, but I just painted and I'm in the process of redoing my room. So I should have a room tour up soon for you guys because it's almost done. I just have a few more things to do and put together and yeah, but I'm going to show you a few DIY room ideas that are cute and easy to do and yeah i hope you guys enjoy the video don't forget to comment like and subscribe and let's get in to the video so the first diy are these chalkboard picture frames and i forgot to record when i made them but all you need are some picture frames and spray paint i sprayed the outside with this glittery black spray paint and the inside with the chalkboard and then you can just write whatever you want on them and I think they turned out really cute. So the next thing is this floral monogram and I saw this on Pinterest. For this you will need a letter, some fake flowers, and some scissors. You're also going to need a hot glue gun and some glue sticks and first thing you want to do is cut your flowers off the stems. After you're done cutting your flowers, you can start gluing down your flowers to the monogram and just want to place them and figure out where you want to put them and the rest is kind of self-explanatory so I'm going to fast forward through this process and you can see how it turns out in the end. Once your full monogram is done, it should look something like this. And I really like the way this turns out. I think it is so pretty. And, um, and here it is, hung up on my wall. So the next DIY is another monogram, but this one is a plaque monogram, which is for my sister's room. For this, you'll need a plaque, a letter, some paint, and some sponge brushes. So the first thing my sister did was trace out the letter J just to make sure that the hot glue would attach the two pieces of wood together. Then she opened up her paint and she started to paint this pretty blue color and she got all of these products for this, product, for this project from Joanne Fabrics. So after you finish the plaque part, you need to paint your initial or you can leave it the same way but she chose this pretty gold color and she just painted two layers of it so it wasn't as see through and yeah that's about it. Once you finish painting that, you just want to find the center of your board and put the hot glue on the back of your letter and just put it in place and it will dry pretty quickly. And then you'll end up with something like this and I think it's really cute. Now I'm going to show you how to make this vintage picture frame and all you need is a picture frame and some paint. And my sister is just using the same paints from the last DIY that I just showed you. And to start out you just want to paint your frame this blue color or whatever color you chose to use. Once you're done with your base color, you want to go in with your second color for my sister that was the gold color and you just want to paint it in little 
spots wherever you think that it looks good to make it look vintage and rustic and if that you are done. And you should end up with something that looks a little like this and I think it turns out really, really cute. So the last DIY are these chalkboard containers and all you'll need for these are chalkboard spray paint and two containers. The containers I have is this one which is shoe shopping and then I have this other one which is just a little red shiny container. So all I did was spray paint these two containers. I just did a double coat on each of them and on the red container I just did this one side because the paint was kind of sliding off but in the end it ended up working pretty good. So after I finished spray painting I let these dry overnight and then when they were done I just wrote on them. I wrote money on this one because it's where I keep all my spare change. The other one I wrote glam box because where I keep my lotions and things like that. Okay guys I hope you enjoyed it this video of quick and easy DIY room decor and um, don't forget to comment like and subscribe me and my sister are trying to get to a thousand subscribers so please hit the red button below and we would so appreciate it and once we hit a thousand we want to do a giveaway for you guys so help us give you free stuff and yeah that's it for this video and I'll see you guys next time bye